For more videos on people's struggles, please subscribe to our YouTube channel. In response to a call by the Palestine General Federation of Trade Unions, PGFTU, for an international week of action between June 2nd and 9th, thousands organized protests in major ports of North America. In a move to hold Israel accountable for its crimes on Palestinians, activists and workers' movements have put up pickup lines on major ports in the United States and Canada to block entry for Israeli ships. The protesters stopped operations and blocked ships operated by Israeli cargo companies from docking. Protests have been held at the ports of Oakland, Los Angeles, Houston and New Jersey, among other places. A wide array of anti-imperialist and progressive groups and coalitions across the United States have joined together to organize these actions. We're, we're here today to sort of uh, send a message um, to the Zim company uh, that we are going to do what we can to make sure that you do not do business on our, on our shores uh, and continue to profit off of the Israeli apartheid. We're participating in global movement for boycott, divestment, sanctions, and embargo in Israel. Um, and if our government is going to continue to support Israel economically and support them uh, through military aid, we were going to do, we're going to do what we can. The campaign targets incoming ships operated by the Israel-based Zim Integrated Shipping Services Limited, or Zim. Historically, Zim has been tied to the Settler Colonial Project of Israel, having been one of the shipping companies to transport early Zionist settlers. Zim is also currently one of the biggest transporters of weapons to and from Israel. Oakland witnessed the first of these pickets and prevented two Zim ships from docking. Zim had not attempted to use the Oakland port since 2014, when pro-Palestinian activists blocked its ships from docking for months. On June 2nd, the Oakland Dock Workers Chapters of the International Longshore and Warehouse Union, ILWU, Local 10, joined organizers from more than 30 organizations from the Block the Boat Coalition to picket. On Friday, June 4th, an estimated 1,000 people showed up to the port to prevent the docking of the ships. A picket in New Jersey was met with heavy police presence and armored vehicles sent by the police departments of New York City and New Jersey. According to reports, there was an initial standoff between peaceful and unarmed protesters and the police, as the latter were refusing the picketers from entering the docks. But eventually the protesters prevailed. Similar demonstrations are happening elsewhere, with more pickets planned for ports like Detroit, Michigan and Vancouver in the coming days. Dock workers in Italy's Livorno and across South Africa also heeded the call for action and boycotted Israeli cargo ships during the bombing of Gaza.